Chief Tony Okoroji puts Kosin House on the locking key as members hold meeting outside. The last has not been heard of the ongoing Kosin crisis as more drama unfolds. On Tuesday, March 6, 2018, some members of Kosin, led by the chairman of the copyright collection body, Ife Omorugbe, unexpectedly held a meeting outside the Kosin building. Present at the meeting were few members of Kosin. The chairman, Ife Omorugbe, NCC representative Obi Eze, Kosin directors Obi Asika and Baba D. According to the current chairman of the body, the building was locked down on the instructions of Chief Tony Okoroji to intentionally prevent him and some members of the organization from gaining access. While speaking to Hib TV, the chairman, some of the members and directors of the body expressed their displeasure on the current situation of things. It is a working day, so I'm shocked that um, custom building is locked 24 hours. I, I believe earlier on it was open when I passed here earlier on, so I'm shocked that it's closed for the board to sit for their meeting. So, um, We had a board meeting last year on December 7th, at which we changed our chairman, and we, re and we decided a few things. Most importantly was that board members of COSON would not engage in the business of COSON as consultants or vendors to COSON, and that we would appoint independent auditors to help guide COSON and grow it bigger. And we did this for the benefit of Koson and for all of her members worldwide because we feel that the institution can grow, can have bigger relationships with bigger members of other industries, and you have to do things the right way. Unfortunately, the erstwhile chairman um, has personalized the issue and has sought to basically vilify and denigrate and talk down everybody else who has been involved in a process, which is a collective exercise over 20 years. It's a sad thing, but we will overcome that. It's quite unfortunate. It's a very sad day in Nigerian uh, 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 copyright history. You can see the building is shut down. It's a working day. It's 2 p.m. on a Tuesday. And this further points to the illegality uh, perpetuated by Chief Tony Okoroji. It's, it's, a, it's a very sad thing. The instructive thing here is there has to be a probe. Whatever happens uh, from the board level to the NCC level, the key conversation is that everybody concerned must demand for a probe. We want Koson to be fully audited. I'll take a Koson audit, a full forensic Koson edit, operations, accounts, over a seat on the board as a director, over, you know, being a chairman. If I'm chairman of Koson and the probe does not go on, then it's, 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 it's meaningless to me.